This is a new one. This is the Blight. Now the Blight doesn't really do much except make you very very slow when you go too close to it and gives you mining fatigue. And he can also summon in some icy minions as well. Let's see if we can get him to do that. It's very rare, but it does happen every now and then. There we go. Snowboy. Isn't he cute? Well, they've got little tiny little daggers, but there's nothing to this guy apart from the MBT and making the Blight a little bit more interesting. Now, I'm going to warn you, the Blight has a ton of health and does a shocking amount of damage. So, the best way to kill him is actually via TNT. So, let's grab some TNT out. And as, as you can see, as soon as we ignite the thing, oh, he starts taking damage when he's around it. So let's go, there we go. And you have to do that quite a few times, but it is a lot faster and more reliable than just attacking him. So he is quite a challenge to take down. You could just hit him with your sword, but that will take ages and you will probably not survive. So this is the best way to do it. All right, let's see if we can get him to die yet. Nope, still not yet. Pretty powerful. He, he also only spawns in snowy areas, just for your information. Okay, probably also easier to set multiple TNT off. Oh, oh he's dead. Ah, oh, I didn't drop the bone. Not that the bone does anything yet, because I actually want your suggestions. What should that bone do? All right, there we go. So he drops this bone. It's just a blight bone. Doesn't do anything as of now, but I have reserved command blocks to do that. So, how did I do the mechanics? Well, area of effect cloud to do the mining fatigue and such. You have to be close within a radius of 10 and also does the particles for us. And then how did I make it so the TNT has such a huge difference on it? Well, we're going to execute from that mob. We are executing from time prime TNT and if that's successful, then it will give instant health. But now I might buff this up just a tiny bit because it is a little bit underpowered and I want you to use the TNT rather than just swinging your sword at him. And the last one, it only summons minions if you are outside a radius of four and within a radius of five. So it can happen, but it, it's just very rare because those conditions are rarely met. So thanks everyone for watching this video on the Blight. If you have any suggestions for the Blight item, then please let me know in the comments. It has to be very, very simple because I want this to be a lag-free command. But thanks everyone for watching. I will see you in the next one. Take care.